In New Jersey, authorities have made an arrest in the killing of a local city council member. The woman was only a few weeks into her job when she was found shot to death in her own car. Her murder went unsolved for four months. NBC News reporter Maya Eaglin is following this story for us. Maya, what do we know? Hi, Zane Clay. Sayreville, New Jersey, Congresswoman Eunice Duomfor was found in her car shot multiple times on February 1st. And now, more than 100 days later, police have finally arrested the person they say is responsible. The suspect's name is Rashad Ali Bynum. He's 28 years old and he was taken into custody early Tuesday morning in Virginia, 340 miles away from where the killing happened. He's been charged with first degree murder, second degree unlawful possession of a handgun and second degree possession of a handgun for unlawful purpose. A search of the councilwoman's phone found that the suspect's contact information was saved on her phone with the acronym FCF, which stands for Fire Congress Fellowship. A church councilwoman Duom for was previously affiliated with. Prosecutors also said cell phone data puts Bynum in the area of Sayreville on the night of the killing. And according to officials, in the days before the murder, he was allegedly searching online for Duom Ford's current address, the area of Sayreville, and ammunition magazines for a specific handgun. A prosecutor in Middlesex County, New Jersey, says the councilwoman and the suspect apparently knew each other, but Duong Force family has no idea who he is. The attorney for Duong Force family spoke to reporters after the arrest was announced. As you can imagine, uh, there are, for them, uh, even more questions today than there were before. While prior to today, they wanted to know who was responsible, and we have an alleged uh, uh, murderer in custody in Virginia, but now uh, they are trying to also understand the relationship, uh, how this person came to target Eunice. This case has rocked that local New Jersey community. Sayreville's previous mayor also recently resigned over a threatening letter she received related to Duom Force killing. The suspect is currently in custody in Virginia and awaiting extradition to New Jersey. Sinclair. Disturbing details. Hopefully the family has a little closure, though. Maya Eaglin, thank you. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.